So, I don't know Emily Ratajkowski, is that that? Personally, uh, I have friends that do, and they've always said that she's down-to-earth, reasonable, intelligent, you know, all that sort of stuff, which, great. Um, and that interaction I had with her, I just thought would be a one-off whatever thing. Uh, and it had nothing to do with her. It had everything to do with that thieving piece of garbage. And I think what this probably boils down to is just people have a blind spot for their friends. That's the way it is. Like, we're... It's hard to sometimes see your friends as pieces of shit in a certain arena and in this case um, it's everything that guy stands for and ever will stand for he is garbage trash I certainly have friends in the, that are sort of similar um, when you're a comic you kind of just you're friends with a lot of garbage people and sometimes you block it out and you go like yeah but so I think that's what's happening here and I did not expect to be endlessly scrolling through Twitter all day dealing with these um, comments and a lot of guys are being stupid hopefully she can sort of like look at it from a slightly different perspective and you know at least call sometimes you gotta call your friends out on stuff so if only that comes out of it um, that'd be cool um you know, I know we're probably going to laugh about this one day when we're married 20 years from now and go, ha ha, remember that. Um, and that's probably not going to happen because she's married to a villain from Miami Vice. And it's just the way the world works sometimes. Anyway, uh, today's song is a um, song that has many meanings. And this will be a short, simple one. Um, Father and Son by Cat Stevens. It is heartbreaking. It's, it could be, I think, literally about father and son, parent, child dynamic, where it's like, you don't get it, I'm this, you'll see. Um, or it's just, you know, dealing with any sort of uh, form of authority and fighting your way out, um, or just trying to find your own road. It doesn't have to be authority, just trying to find your own sense of freedom um, and identity. And I've kind of used all of those meanings over the years. And interesting fact, he didn't write it about his own relationship with his dad. I saw that in an interview where he said his was always great. They were always supportive. He just saw that a lot of people had that in their lives. And him being a great songwriter um, turned that into a classic. And I'm sure if someone else, um, say, covered that song and didn't give him credit for it, um, and even tried to pass off that he was uh, Cat Stevens, I'm sure there'd be a huge problem with that. See you tomorrow.